As you can see, I have the Venus GPS module from SparkFun plugged into the expansion headers along with an antenna. And I can turn the board on and we'll see what happens. So it's a searching for position fix. Uh, this usually takes a few seconds. This, is, this will be a hot fix as um, the VBAT pin on the GPS has been uh, attached to the battery. But anyway, we have the position fix active and a latitude and longitude is being displayed in decimal degree format. And uh, this is updated once per second in real time. The microcontroller receives uh, NMEA strings from the GPS module, parses that information, and then updates the display. We have the option to start recording by pushing this button. This will send a command to the Venus module that uh, it should start locking the coordinates to flash. So I'll push it, and uh, now you can see that uh, it says recording. Um, again, we have latitude and longitude, and now it's also calculating distance since the start recording button has been pushed. Uh, this distance is calculated by the microcontroller using the Haversine formula. We also have the option to stop recording now. This sends a command to the GPS module to uh, stop recording coordinates to flash. Um, and at this point you can turn the board off and uh, download the coordinates or you can uh, push begin again in which case you are taken back to the first screen uh, that just shows latitude and longitude and the option to start recording again. Okay, now we have the AT Mega 162 experimenters board hooked up to a uh, RS-232 cable here and the NMEA serial strings coming out of the GPS module are being sent uh, through an RS-232 level converter and out the DB9 port, which we then have hooked up to a computer running the SkyTrack GPS viewer software. This um, software shows you uh, the various uh, parameters and settings associated with the GPS module. And uh, over here you can see the uh, NMEA strings coming in from the serial port. Um, this software also allows you access to a lot of the binary commands for configuring the GPS module um, and also allows you access to the data log uh, log read batch command which can be used to download all the saved GPS coordinates from flash and also this log decompress uh, command which decompresses the uh, log file and turns it into a file that's readable by Google Earth and Google Maps.